We'll now look at the second of our office system options, which is Quick Office. We've already looked at Drive, and there's a little video on that. This is Quick Office, also owned by Google. Press on that, and that's going to open up. And it actually looks quite similar to Drive. In fact, it integrates Drive within it. Uh, now, the important thing about Quick Office is that it can save documents to your tablet or to your phone. You don't have to be connected to the cloud to do this. Anyway, let's make a document, a quick office. So we press on the plus button there, and we've got document, a spreadsheet, or a presentation, slightly different um, format looking than Drive. So let's go for document, and it will open up the panel in which we're going to enter the data again. Now, a little trap for young players here is that the initial font size is very small, as you can see by the way I typed in test there. So let's get rid of that, and I always change the font size by touching on this icon, which brings up my fonts, and I'll change that size from 11, say, to 20. Uh, and now, when I look at it, this is... A, and of course you can use your you can use your swipe if you want to but we won't in this scenario so that'll do um, if we get into there uh, we can add more as, as we go on um, now again like the other one like drive we've got our little tick box up here so let's go and save it and we're going to change the name That will save it as a, uh, we'll call this one, test four. And you'll notice we've got the option of saving to Google Drive or to internal storage, which means onto the phone. So I'm going to choose internal storage. And then it comes up and it's showing me, these are the folders, by the way, which sit on my phone. We can see in the, in the file and folder videos later on. And I press the little save button there, and it has saved it to my phone. So that's an example of Quick Office, which is another option uh, in addition to Google Drive.